I took my kid to a children's party. Uh, the people had really gone to quite a lot of effort. Um, it was nine o'clock start, which that is why I signed up for kid duty, because that's the sort of time of day I can just about handle. But I'd forgotten that kids are mental, so it's nine in the morning. Right, I, I know, a party at nine in the morning. Yes, I'd love to do that with my life. Um, <laughs> and uh, the, the, it's difficult to describe uh, how horrendous a situation this was to be in hungover, but in the moment, we're going to recreate it. The uh, thing was, it wore on for three or four hours. In a second, we're going to recreate it uh, over the course of just 60 seconds. So in one minute, I can bring you down to what I regard as my mental lowest point, and then for the rest of the show, it'll be all about healing, collectively. Um, <laughs> uh, so to set the scene, uh, there were balloons everywhere. This is the worst thing. Uh, I know that balloons are common at parties, but I hate balloons. I hate it when they burst. I don't like any sort of sudden loud noises. I'm quite an anxious person. It doesn't really come across on stage. But I, um, <laughs> this Mr. Cool thing is just a persona, really. Uh, so any sudden noises, balloons bursting, uh, that sneeze for... Uh, <laughs> that's a shame. That, that, was, that was actually really good. But uh, that will look like a setup on TV. But someone did make an unbelievable noise, just as I was saying, I don't like noises. Um, <laughs> I don't any loud noises. Thunder and lightning, bombs, I hate being bombed. <laughs> so if you imagine, there's like hundreds of balloons everywhere. Um, is the bombs thing weird? I'm just one of those guys. Anytime I'm in an airstrike, I'm like, no, let's get out of here. And it's, um, it's a quirk. So there's balloons everywhere, littering the ground, with tiny feet about to stamp on them any moment. Um, there were whistles as well, which, of course, if you give kids whistles, they'll blast away on them. There was a little play tent, which my kid immediately crawled into um, and then defended from other kids with Putin-like ferocity. Um, <laughs> putting me on a negative footing with almost every other parent there. There was music coming out of four different speaker systems, but all slightly out of time with each other. Um, uh, plus the mother whose uh, party, it, well, who, whose kid was having the party, was pursuing me everywhere, going, are you having a nice time? Is he enjoying it? Are you having a good time? Um, until I started to wish that she would basically fuck off. But uh, it's, again, not the sort of thing you can really say. So, we're going to now recreate all of these elements so that for one minute you can feel as bad as I did on this day in 2013. Uh, first of all, who'd like to blow a whistle? This is a pretty easy volunteering job. I've got four whistles. You've just got to blast away on it like an excited three or four-year-old would. Anyone? Yes, hand up there. That's... Uh, um, yeah, just about carries. One at the front there is good. And then maybe a couple on that side. Or uh, one up in the circle would be good, actually. Well, yeah, what about one down there? And then, um, that's gone slightly wide. That's, but it was still, I think that was catchable. Catches with matches, mate. Um, <laughs> if I go on to make 100 now, you'll regret that. And then, the thing is, you're just a, um, well, two things, really. You're sort of almost too close for it to be a challenge. And also, it looks like you've got your pyjamas on from here. Um, <laughs> is that, I mean, am I sort of being unfair? I, um... So I think I'll give it to someone that's just a bit further back and has day wear on. Um, <laughs> having said this, I'm going to look quite the twat if this doesn't quite reach the balcony, which is perfectly ready. OK. Hey, so this is exciting, isn't it? This, it's got it all, this DVD, comedy, sport. Are we ready? Who, who am I aiming for? Yeah, that gentleman now, I think. Glasses, second row. Um, yeah, you, yes, you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. To give you a further clue, the guy that just said here. Yeah. Um, ready? OK, let's go. Um, yes, yeah, maybe if you stand up, just so I've got a target to aim at. Here we go. <laughs> oh! Dramatic scenes, it veered away. That guy in the front of the circle tried to catch it one-handed, but it's gone down. Um, it's it ended up somewhere down there. Never mind, the balloons... Uh, now, the balloons I'm not going to distribute, obviously. Balloons are going to come into the audience in a minute. Um, if you get a balloon, obviously, burst it. Um, but you don't have to do it straight away. You've got 60 seconds. You can afford to fuck with me a bit. Um, <laughs> as, the, uh, as the kids did, I was going to say. I don't think I will say that. Um, <laughs> there we are. That's an example of West Waring is unhelpful. You can afford to emotionally manipulate me would have been a better way of putting it. Um, we need somebody to be the kid's parent and just pursue me around, going, you're having a nice time, you're enjoying it. Oh, worryingly quick to volunteer there. <laughs> worryingly quick volunteering plus front row equals likely legal ramifications here, but... Uh, <laughs> none of them. All right, well, two of you? I suppose you could take, you could take one side each and I'll sort of run up and down. This is, um, there we go, off they go. What's, uh, um, alarming keenness. Um, <laughs> the, yeah, if you... Well, you're right, yeah. If you, are there treads on that side as well? Yes, you can both get down. OK, so I'll come down into the auditorium and you can just sort of follow me around. And now, this is quite ambitious, but it is a DVD recording, so I've also... I've got the play tent. Um, <laughs> so for the, for the perfect reenactment, uh, someone should really get in this tent and... Um, just the 17-year-old. The 17-year-old, I, uh, <laughs> I, I... 
Well, I... I don't know if I want to go down in history as a man that forced an underage man into a tent... <laughs> as, ..as part of a comedy recording. <laughs> On the other hand, how would you feel about spending some time in the tent? <laughs> you, you can be honest about this. Would you rather stay there? We, we, you don't know? <laughs> He's got every right to not know, I think. <laughs> and he said it in a really measured way as well. I don't know. I am. Um, in your position, I also wouldn't know. Um, does anyone know they actively do want to do it? Yeah, you're having. Come on. Why, why, yeah, go on. Get out of there. Look at that. He even clenched his fist there. Um, so, um, yeah, he has to find your way out. Okay. So, um, what's your name? Crystal, Crystal and. Crystal. Sorry? Crystal, Kristen and Crystal. <laughs> this, is, this is a bit too weird. A, if your name's Christian, I'm going to leave. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Josh. Hi, Josh. In the, um, in the tent you go, I suppose. Um... <laughs> Pretty good. There we go. That's how you do it. OK. I, uh... I... Uh... <laughs> I, uh... <laughs> the biggest round of applause so far there. Uh, uh... <laughs> Not for a joke, just for a man getting into a thing. There we go. Uh, there we go. So... <laughs> Crystal and Kristen, the mysteriously evil twin name, goes, are going to chase me around, just shouting, are you having a nice time? Josh is just going to stay in there, pretending to be my five-year-old. This isn't at all weird. <laughs> the mu we've looped uh, some horrible-sounding music to give you the impression of what it was like. Balloons are going to come down. Right, we're all ready to go. 60 seconds of hell await you as you delve into the, uh, the memory. So, uh, Let's start the clock, start the music. I'm going to play Awful Party Reenactment. Here we go. Release the balloons. Release the music. Here we go. Here come the balloons. And down I go. I'm having a lovely time. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, it's been really good. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm having a really good time. Yeah, no, it's absolutely no. Yeah, thank you. Can you just leave me alone, please? Yeah, I, yeah, I am. Yeah. Oh, shit. Fucking hell. That's horrible. Oh, Fuck off! And on it goes, on it goes, until you start thinking, well... Um, and by the way, I've got no way of ending this. And in that respect, it's exactly like the party. <laughs> so, yeah. 